Hi Taurus, I'm Jennifer Angel. This is my report for you for the week of May the 29th. And this is a very uh, active week. There's a lot going on. It's very progressive. And um, right now we've got like so much activity right around your chart that there's movement and development. All right. So um, with Mercury in your sign and there's a very nice trine and Mercury is a plan of communication. It's very nice. A beneficial interaction with Pluto and this really highlights your soul or purpose so there can be something that's happening at the moment that can either you know put you on the right path or um, give you the and sometimes to put you on the right path is going to take you off the wrong path or um, to give you confirmation in some way so to so you know that you are on the right path so so uh, watch for the signposts, the signs of synchronicity and, you know, all those sort of chance meetings and serendipity. I love that movie. If you've never seen that movie, it's quite special. And uh, and that'll let you know in one way or another, in all sorts of, in all sorts of amazing, magical almost ways that you're on the right path. Now, right before your sign, we've got Venus, your ruler, in a conjunction right on top, exact degree, with Uranus. So this is going to spark your intuition, your imagination, um, and really just helps you get organized um, in your life of what it is that you want. Be careful of keeping secrets. Now, things can come out of the blue. Of course, not every Everybody needs to know all of your business, but you know, with the Venus in that twelfth house position and in that conjunction with Uranus, then um, if you're keeping something from someone who really needs to know, then it can come out during this time. But it's a highly, you know, as I said, your intuition is really sparked now. Um, there can be uh, also. Um, is a nice monetary interaction with your work and you need to be productive to stay on top of that at the same time with money be careful with money with friends okay if there's some like situation that you need to maybe bring to a head then that you know or that uh, is sort of overdue to be dealing with then that can sort of come to the forefront during this time. Um, at the same sense, somebody else can step forward and give you a helping hand uh, with monetary matters too. So it sort of seems to balance out. The main thing is that if there is a situation, opportunity or issue around money, then it then you get a chance to sort of deal with that and either clear it or step into the opportunity so you can um, boost your bank account. So yeah, that's all good. Now the card I've selected to you um, this week is from Doreen Virtue's Ascended Masters Oracle Cards and it's um, her, and the master is Vishnu and the card is trust. Here it is here. And the reason I've selected this card is that there would be so much going on. It's sort of like there's a message to really be proactive, um, be uh, uh, mindful that you have to let make things happen. You can't just let them fall into place. You've got to be um, step in and take the responsibility. But trust that everything will work out as it should. Okay, so life has a habit of, of doing that. And also with last week's new moon in that area of money, then this is a whole new start for you. And Venus is making her way to your sign. So love is very much in the picture now too. Okay, so <clears throat> here's my website. If you'd like to book a um, personal reading with me to uh, have a look at your natal chart and see what's going on there, you can do that through the readings page. Okay, love and luck to you and we'll see you next week. Bye for now.